there, I'm Alisa, and welcome back to the LCL Ocarina YouTube channel. Today, I'm here to help you choose your first ocarina. Deciding to get your own ocarina is exciting, but I also know it can feel a bit overwhelming with all the options out there. No worries, I've got you. While we're here, I invite you to join this amazing ocarina community. Subscribe to our channel for all things Ocarina and like this video to help us reach musicians everywhere. If you haven't watched our previous video on how to identify an Ocarina, I will recommend you checking it out before continuing with this one. I will put a link for that video in the description. Before we dive into how to select your first Ocarina, I have an awesome tool to share with you from SDL Ocarina. We like to call it Ocarina Seeker. It is not just any tool. It is your very own Ocarina search engine and filter. With Ocarina Seeker, you can narrow down your search based on price, your skill level, materials, keys, and even the number of apertures you prefer. Best of all, it is completely free to use. Check out the link in the description below to give it a try. Moving along, Let's get into more details about what to look for when selecting your very first ocarina. To help you in selecting your perfect first ocarina, let's explore two pivotal aspects you should keep in mind. Let's begin by defining your ocarina identity. This is all about understanding your unique preference and requirements as a new ocarina player. To truly define your ocarina identity, it is essential to ask yourself some softball questions. These questions will help you uncover what kind of ocarina will resonate with your unique musical personality. I have put together a bunch of questions for you, along with my own recommendations. Just hit that pause button whenever you like to check them out and see what I suggest. Keep in mind that this list is by no means definitive but it will give you an idea of the type of questions that you should ask yourself. It is like a starting point for your ocarina journey, guiding you towards the perfect ocarina for you. If you're not sure what questions to ask yourself or you are uncertain about the answers to some of these questions, don't worry, I have got you covered. If you've never played a musical instrument before, I'd recommend starting with a six hole or a 12 hole plastic ocarina. These ocarinas are incredibly durable and portable, so you won't need to worry about accidental mishaps as you learn to play, no matter where the music takes you. Now, if you have some prior music experience under your belt, I would suggest considering a 12-hole ceramic ocarina. These ocarinas offer a broader range than a six-hole model, allowing you to tackle most songs you have in mind. Surami ocarinas also produce a beautiful tone that you will truly enjoy. The 12-hole ceramic ocarina strikes an ideal balance for those looking to explore music for the first time and seasoned musicians who want to add to their existing skills and talents. For the experienced musicians out there, it is time to explore the world of double or triple chamber ceramic ocarinas. With their wider piece range and advanced capabilities, these ocarinas are designed to meet the most demanding musical needs. They open up new horizons for creativity and expressions making them the perfect choice for those looking to push the boundaries of their musical artistry. Now, let's shift our focus to crafting your arena adventure. This aspect is all about your goals and what kind of musical journey you want to embark upon the arena. I have also prepared another list of questions for you to consider here. Feel free to hit that pause button anytime you want to read these questions and check out my recommendations. These questions are meant to help you to discover what you want to achieve with your ocarina. I hope some of these questions can push you in the right direction. When it comes to crafting your ocarina adventure, the big question here is, what do you want to do with your ocarina? Are you looking to play specific songs, genres, or styles? In other words, what do you envision doing with your new ocarina? For instance, if you are a passionate fan of the Legend of Zelda series and aspire to master songs from the game, then considering a Zelda-themed ocarina is a logical step. 
this choice can seamlessly weave your love for the game into your musical journey, creating a unique and enchanting experience. But what if you're just curious and not looking for anything fancy? That's cool too. If you simply want to try out an ocarina and see if you like it, go for a simple six hole one. These ocarinas often come in adorable shapes like animals, fruits, or a small necklace. They are not too pricey, making them an excellent choice for your first ocarina adventure. It is a great way to dig your toes into the ocarina world. If you find you're really into it, you can always think about getting a fancier 12 hole ocarina down the road. On the other hand, if you have a long list of demands and you're serious about your ocarina journey, like if you can picture yourself performing in public alongside other musicians, then it is a good idea to think about investing in a top-notch ocarina right from the beginning. Going for a professional grade ocarina from the get-go will offer you several advantages. It gives you fantastic sounds and opens doors to endless musical adventures. Plus, it'll give you room to grow as a musician allowing you to explore advanced technique and tackle complex songs with ease. So for those of you with big musical dreams, consider aiming high with quality ocarina to match your ambitions. As we wrap our discussion of defining your ocarina identity and crafting your ocarina adventure, I hope you're feeling better equipped and inspired to choose your first ocarina. Remember, the journey to finding the ideal ocarina is as unique as you are. Understanding your preference, needs, and musical goals will help you to successfully select your ideal ocarina. Whether you're starting your own musical journey with ocarina or continuing to expand your musical horizons, know that the world of ocarinas is rich and diverse, offering a wide range of options to suit your needs. Take your time, explore, and don't be afraid to ask me any questions you have along the way. Thank you for joining me today. If you find this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe to stay updated on more Ocarina tips and tutorials. I can't wait to see where your Ocarina journey takes you. Until next time, happy playing and keep practicing.